This is Living Power with Dan Hurst. Now, let this promise in 1 Peter serve as a reminder and a warning to everyone who ignores the intents and designs of God. God is listening to the cries of the righteous, and he will respond in kind, whether you are a political authority that despises the word of God, a religious extremist that believes he should kill all who disagree with him, or a church member who thinks your ways are the best, even if they're opposed to the word of God. Now make no mistake about what I just said. When I say that he, God will respond to anybody who is, who is uh, against him, who stands against him, who does evil, who speaks out or represents that which is opposed to God's will and God's way. When, when a political authority despises the word of God, God comes against him. And make no mistake, I am talking about our political authorities locally, statewide, and nationally. Washington, D.C. needs to get this message. When choices are made that violate the word of God, they have God coming against them. God stands against those who do evil. No matter how they encouch it, no matter how they word it, no matter what their, what their facade is, no matter how they look, if they are intending evil that rebels against the word of God, God stands against them. How about those, those extremists that believe that they should kill everybody who disagrees with them. And by the way, I'm not only just talking about Islam extremists, I'm talking about all kinds of extremists. When you defy and despise the word of God, then God stands against you. We don't, I don't, but God does. Why am I not standing against them? Because my job is to continue doing righteous and to be holy. It's not my job to fight them. It's my job to be righteous and to be holy. But God stands against them. And church people who are disagreeing with the word of God, who intentionally violate the word of God, oh, well, that doesn't really apply here. It's the word of God. It applies. And church people who ignore the word of God or don't follow the truths and principles of the word of God, God stands against them. They are under discipline. So all of these type of people, if they're in opposition to the word of God, the eyes of the Lord are on the righteous and his ears are open to their prayer, but his face is against those who do evil. On behalf of Dan Hurst and the Open Class, we want to thank you for watching. We hope it was a blessing.